ladies and gentlemen, now for your official introduction, the fighter fighting out of the red corner, weighing in at 66.2. He's at 20, stands 5'9". He fights out of Sheffield, shoot fighters and hills from Sheffield, Billy the Lad Powell. And his opponent fighting out of the blue corner, weighing in at 65.2. He's at 20, stands 5'8". He fights out of Middlesbrough Fight Academy and hails from Middlesbrough, Zanya Cameron. Your referee, Mr. Nico Joker. Well, ladies and gentlemen, our seventh fight of the evening is an amateur featherweight bat. Billy Powell fighting out of the red corner in the black tie shorts with white pride trim. He represents Sheffield Shoot Fighters with a 1-0 record as he takes on the debuting Zanya Cameron from MFA. And if we've seen anything tonight, is that both Sheffield Shoot Fighters and MFA have come to fight and win. Absolutely, so I believe both camps are both camps are undefeated so far. I think far they're both 2-0. 2-0, yeah, yeah absolutely. So this is the tiebreaker. Let's see who gets it. Well, they are both game. I've got to admit, Powell, Powell looks extremely... Well, both of them look extremely yeah. thick featherweights. Pa Powell looks very strong, very... Um, Dense. Cameron again, fighting in the black shorts trimmed with red. Both the Hardwick brothers in his corner. So you know that there's some, you yeah. know there's some quality sparring down there. Nice, nice yeah. shot to the body. And we've seen how the Hardwick uh, brothers uh, fight. So, uh, you know, they're a product of that gym and it's a very exciting, dominant style. And we just got Cameron closing the distance now. It looked very 50-50 on the feet, but it was just on the, uh, you know, on the exit. You saw Cameron just taking one or two extra shots on the exit. Well, now he's looking to chip away. He's going to sit yeah. down in that half guard. He's like, yeah, I got you one or two extra shots. Here's your receipt. <laughs> Absolutely, and now happy to work top position. That's it, and he just smiles over at his corner. He has one of the Hardwicks in stitches. Sorry, Hardwicks, I can't tell the difference between you, but <laughs> you're both absolute killers, and I'm a fan. <laughs> Is he setting up the? He looked look, like he was for the head and yes. arm, perhaps there. And he was just—you see him just reach across and apply the shoulder pressure to get the arm to come up, and then he was going to clamp it down. Oh, knee to the body! Oh. Thank you very much. You can retire happy now. You've made Steve. You've made Steve's That's night. It. I'm going to have to go and thank the corner team. <laughs> Billy looking out of his depth, giving up the head and arm there. But Cameron just on top, chipping away. Yeah, he's side control here. With that cross face. Billy just looking lost on his back right now. Um, well, it's, as you can see, he's trying to scramble to that, trying to get to the hip, trying to get the shoulders yeah. off the canvas bit. Cameron just not letting it happen. Sometimes you can be well versed in this position like I'm sure Billy is, but when you plan and get into the rhythm of a stand-up fight and then it gets taken away, you're like, it takes a couple of seconds to catch up where you're like, oh, okay then. Good work there as gets his Cameron guard tried, to, tried to float over. Powell earned the guard back. And, and Cameron just staying active here. I mean, Powell staying active. Oh, he's he's looking doing for the leg. The right things, but beautiful attempt. And that's where you want it in the last 10 seconds of a round where... Yeah, you're going to look for yeah. something. I'm still up, and, and then he's, he's punching away to finish the round. And Good first round from the MFA, man. That's it. You've got to say, uh, you've got to say that was definitely... It started... There was not much to separate him except for maybe the odd strike on the disengagement on the feet. Then when Cameron got it to the floor, yeah, we it, just, he was dominant. We just saw there that... Powell landed a big right hand, has landed a couple of big right hands, but... That's it, and you see where Cameron's at range, that's where Powell's getting those extra shots in, but when Cameron was on the floor with Powell, Powell looked like he was playing catch up a little bit. He finally got his guard back when he did. Cameron dropped to the sneak, a little footlock. And why not, with 10 seconds <laughs> left to go? What's the worst that's gonna happen, eh? Well, 10 seconds. <sighs> We yeah. have seen fights end in eight. <laughs> <laughs> Leon Edwards, Seth. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know. Yeah. Well, what a big night for UK combat oh. sports it is tonight. Anthony Joshua. I mean, if you're into that boxing hey. thing, you got Anthony Joshua. You've got MVP. Yeah. Bare knuckle. 
You, you know, got Dakota DeJava showing up at PFL alongside you Manchester Luke, top yeah. team. Leon Edwards and then the, yeah. challenging for the belt. Challenging, Leon, that's, that's Leon's belt. The, the camera's just been holding on to it. Oh, yes. <sighs> And now oh, Billy, some big shots now, coming that's from the biggest Sheffield strike shoot. of the fight so far. And you can see Cameron tightening up that guard. He's going to look. You, I almost feel like as soon as Powell overextends a little bit, Cameron's yeah. going to look for that body lock again. Yeah, but Cameron just caught him a second ago, and Billy's left foot went. It went a bit wobbly. And he stumbled out of it. So both men having so oh, a big body kick followed by the jab off to the side. Nice. Uh, so now Billy is carrying the power. When he lands, he's doing the most damage. But I think Cameron's got that first round out of the. Look how fast that left hook was. Damn yeah, What a fight we've got on his hands here. Absolutely. Billy Put a little indecisive about what he wanted there. You hear the corner straight away say, no, Billy, no. They they want him to keep working a little bit at range, yep. not let Xander Cameron. Going to try and pummel. Let it. And Billy just looking now. He he initiated the clinch. Yeah, but now, but now hands lo locked underneath the hips. He takes him, him up away. and Oi. deposits him again right into his own corner. Now we've got to see, we've got to see what Billy's got going on here. Um, the first round, he he took the brunt of the punishment on the ground. But as we've already seen tonight, the third round, everything can change. Everything can change. And we've got one, approaching one minute left in this round. Very, very similar to the first round. Both men standing, not afraid to trade. Both then ending up on the floor. And Cameron again in a top position. Yeah, that's something that we, oh, got to be careful. Rolling for the guillotine, no, but let's it go. Let, realized he didn't have it, let it go. And Billy Powell uses that moment to scramble back. To nice outside trip back there by Cameron. Back to his feet, only being taken back down that's again. That's it. And just a subtle little push of the right oh, shoulder. turning now, giving the back up. Body Straight triangle. Straight into the body triangle. This is not second. looking good for Billy. 30 seconds to work. Got those hands out. And just floating over to the mount. Billy's going to try. You can see he's trying to, trying to work into that. And he does. Turns his nice neck. Good work. work from the Sheffield shoot fighter there. 10 Thanks. seconds left to go. Stay, trying to stay heavy on that clinch, take the back. Looking for the roll out. A little cheeky Granby roll. And now that there wasn't Billy's round, but you've no. got to take, you've got to take the momentum. You've got to take the momentum, the shift of momentum there. He was able to do something that he couldn't do in the first round, which was reverse the position. Absolutely. Cameron and, though, yeah. hasn't, hasn't had his back to the mat at all in this oh. fight. And We've got Billy taking the seat with his arms on his coach's shoulders. We've got Cameron who's just come back upright, but of course the figure of a very, very tired man. And mm. Why wouldn't he be? Absolutely. It's his debut, the adrenaline, the output, everything. Oh, he's He's been made to work for the positions he's yeah. got. Billy's not giving him anything for free. He's really not. Oh, yeah. Be beautiful transition to the body triangle there, but this is... This is where he was kind of floating line. You could see Billy just working, working, working until he reversed that position. Yeah. And he hasn't quit on himself yet as Billy. He's kept him in the fight. He's got three minutes to change his fortunes here, and we've seen it happen a couple of times tonight. Absolutely. So. Third and final round here in this amateur featherweight contest. Daniel Cameron, the MFA pr prospect in the black and red shorts. Billy Powell from Sheffield Shoot Fighters in the black tie shorts with the white trim. And Ooh, that left hand staggered down. him for a moment. Big body kick caught by Powell. Ooh, nice beautiful front. stabbing teep there by Cameron. Goes to the body again, this Cameron. And, and Billy still carrying the more power, but throwing the fewer shots. Absolutely. And just looking at how Cameron covers up and 
When his man goes high, he drops to the body. When his man goes low, he comes to the head. And he's just so composed to stay within the striking range and do that. That is a very, very experienced striker. He's happy working in that pocket. He is. Bill is still carrying some power, though. That big overhand right hand. But it's every time he goes round, Cameron goes straight through the middle. Knees to the body there, very nice. Much better round so far from Powell. But, nice little snapping jab, that. Absolutely, just missing with that. Powell just looks exhausted now. He's not giving up on himself, he's not quitting on himself, which you can't teach that. That'll be with him forever. And he Pretty wings easy. that right hand. Uses the under, tries to, but good work from Cameron now again. Just gonna keep sit his in that half nice guard. and heavy, float along with it and end up on top. Billy did have the, uh, he did have the butterfly. He tried to reverse his fortunes, but. Side control now. Sam Bolt there calling his man to scramble to him. Corner team imploring him to get his back to the cage, and he does so does Billy Powell. He's listening well to what he has to do. But that body lock control there by yep. Cameron, just keeping him where he wants his man. Look at how he stepped over the hips. Closed down the knee shield, and now he's in there. Just Yeah, he's either going to get the back he's or the mount, He's got the wrist control. He? He's got the handcuff. That's it. And now he just needs to let go with some shots, and it could be. There we go. 13 seconds left. This is going to, again, leave a really good impression in the it eyes is, of the judges. Yes. And on you know, taking the back, trying to, trying to work for that rear naked, but no time left. And hats off to Billy Powell. He showed the heart of a fighter, and he, t technically, he, he was good. He had the power in his hands, but he was just bested on the ground. That was the deciding factor there. They were both tit for tat on the feet, but on the ground, it was all Cameron tonight. Yeah, again, Billy never never got a ch chance to be offensive in, uh, uh, from on a top position yeah. on the ground, yeah. but that's because Daniel Cameron did not give him the opportunity. No, he didn't. And the one time that the one time that he was reversed, it, there was so little time left on the clock. Yep. Well, while we wait for Mr. Sefcon to enter the cage, we we'll give a quick shout out to CS Combat Sports, MMA TV, and MMA Reloaded, our media partners here at Almighty Fighting Championships. And uh, yeah, what a fight. These are the fights that go into the decision tonight, they're exciting, they're not snooze face. Oh, absolutely. They're non-stop, and look at the respect there between two young up-and-coming fighters. Fight There's going to be some days. great stuff going forward from them. Let's met Mr. Seth Khan make this one official. Ladies and gentlemen, after three hard four rounds, we go to the judges' scorecard, which are as follows. 30-27, 30-27, and 30-27. Declaring your winner in the blue corner, Zanyar Kamaran. Please show your appreciation for Billy Powell. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to have a 10-minute interval. 10-minute interval. Thank you.